What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's your Section 8 Queen, Talaya Honey. And I'm talking funny because I ain't got no teeth. <laughs> they took my teeth out, y'all. They took my teeth out. What am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to be a Section 8 Queen with missing teeth? Please tell me. But that's just a little FYI. Don't have no kids. And if you had kids, don't have no more because the next pregnancy could be you. I done had over 80 kids. And you know, I never had this problem with all 79 of them. But once I had that last one, the 80th child, child, mm -mm. my teeth said, you done. We're not, we're not finna keep playing with you. Stop having kids or we're going to keep messing up your teeth. So that's what they decided to do, child. So now my teeth messed up and I ain't got no teeth on the set. And I got to get them to pay for my veneers. If I really want them, I don't know if I really want any more work done to my mouth at the moment. I'm going to just let them give me the little partial thing and I'm going to see how I feel. Because right now my mouth is in too much pain for them to be messing with over and over okay i have to wait 30 days to even go get back to even go back and get some work done yeah and yeah i was not done with my hair and i'm still not done with my hair and i'm really don't know if i'm even gonna finish my hair because i know how i get it got it's too much stuff to go on out here like it's just too much stuff for me to do i'm so sorry because i sound so funny and my teeth on the side and they put this little cap thing on my other two because I got to wait for my real implant, whatever they said it was called, whatever, or crown or something like that. Mm-hmm. So the fake one they got on here now, or the temporary one, not fake, the temporary one, it's a little uncomfortable. And it's a little big. So, like, I feel like Steve Harvey with these damn teeth in my mouth, y'all. But anyways, judge me all you want to. I'm real on this channel. And I want to say thank you to my 9,000 400 and something something subscribers i really appreciate y'all and to the people who i have gifted my e-guide to i really hope it helps you i really hope you utilize all the information in there and i really hope you're not scared to just record and make your money it's a stepping stone you got to take your time don't rush it don't just put on no bullcrap content even though i feel like i do that but it worked in my favor because my content is realistic do not copy me please do not copy my niche not my niche but you know my mannerisms don't copy me once you start watching somebody, you tend to copy up what they do. And I appreciate it, but if I come to your channel and I see you doing exactly how I do it, saying what I say, I'm going to need you to fix that because that, that can stop your bag. That can stop your views because you might lose viewers from it. They don't like to watch the same type of people who do the same exact type of thing or talk the same exact type of way. If you understand what I'm saying, no tea, no shade, no hate, whatever the saying is. But yeah... My mouth hurts really bad, y'all. And y'all keep recommending all this stuff. I ain't got no extra money. Y'all talking about some over-the-counter, this, this, and that. They gave me Motra and Tylenol, baby. I got to make it do what it do. In my Jamie Foxx voice. But, you know, yeah, my kitchen is a mess. And I don't care. Because, you know, y'all already know the Section 8 queen. When she tired, she tired. She go to bed. She don't care who judges. I only clean up when the Section 8 people say they coming. Because I don't want nobody thinking I look a mess. Not that I really care. But you get it, you get it, you get it. You ain't supposed to have a messy apartment. And I don't feel like it's that messy. It's lived in, for real. I load the dishwasher like three times a day. And yeah, thank you, Joyce, for all the stuff you sent us. I am going to put it in this video, I think. I'm going to put it in this video. Or I'm just going to add it to the new video because we did get some more stuff today, girl. You always showing us so much love. She's my number one supporter. Even when my channel was growing, she was here. She was supporting, commenting, sharing, watching. She got a whole family watching me, y'all. Like, the support is amazing. I really appreciate y'all. And I make four figures a month now. You can't tell me nothing. You can't tell me nothing. I am blessed and highly favored by the Lord. I didn't have to get up in the morning and... Be mad. I got to leave my kids and go to work for somebody who can replace me. If something happened to me, who won't let me call off because of my kids who don't care if I got kids. They don't care if I need to leave 10 minutes early, 15 minutes early. Go get my kids to go get the other kids. They don't care about none of that. But YouTube, honey, YouTube has allowed me to stay at home with my children and make money. And to all y'all who keep wishing Section 8 kicked me off, that's not how it work. I can make $1,500 a month and still have Section 8 because that ain't really nothing. If you divide that up, that's what people make every week, every weekend. Divide fifteen hundred up, they get that in a check. Okay, that's just a regular freaking income. I just make it on my phone, and I feel like it's a blessing because I already got to struggle or do much to make it, but make videos. And yeah, I don't know. 
a lot of y'all just keep coming to me asking me for help but then when i search up your channel and search up your name and see how what y'all been commenting on my page you got the nerve to tell me i need to stop laying on my back one lady asked me for help but did you forget i can see your comments bookie so no i will not be helping you can kiss this ass that you said lay on okay thank you thank you and yes y'all i do do one-on-ones but they are not free they are not for the free ski okay everything i learned i learned myself i taught myself so i'm gonna need a little money to help you okay i'm gonna need a little money for my little opinions and what works for me does not always work for everyone else. So that's just a little disclaimer. But y'all be wanting the money, but y'all don't want to put in the work. You have to put in the work. Y'all know I post sometimes two to three times a day. Recently, for the past week, I've only posted like one video, maybe two videos or three, maybe. I may have posted three videos twice this week and posted one or two for the rest of the days. That's only because I'm making so much money. I feel like I ain't got to keep posting three videos a day. But... I'm still not trying to mess up my bag. I want all the money I can get in one month. Like, if I, I need to hit 5000 a month. That's my goal. And, yeah. So, I'm going to be back pushing out three videos a day. But I got to catch up on emails. I will be emailing everybody back. I started before I started doing this voiceover. And, yeah, I was supposed to make some chili. And I'm glad that I grabbed a new pack of meat. Because who the fuck finna eat that? Not me. Not me. And say what I know they wrong for selling that old ass meat like that. And I, I was I was only in the refrigerator for a day. I bought it yesterday. Why is it brownish, purplish looking? Like, no. Something told me to go to the store and give me a new pack of meat. And that's what the hell I did. That's what I did, okay? Like, to I don't know why they be playing with us, putting color and shit on this meat, trying to play. Even though we ain't supposed to be eating it no way. We ain't supposed to be eating it no way. And, yeah. Y'all want to learn something? Y'all want to learn something right now? So, I was scrolling on TikTok. And they said back in the day. They said back in the day the slaves used to eat the scraps from the Thanksgiving foods and the big holiday meals. And they would season it with a lot of salt. Because salt is a preservative. And then they said that's why we do that to this day. And I was just like, damn. That kind of look. kind of messed me up a little bit. Because now I feel bad. I do season my food a lot, and I do hate meat. I do hate the smell of meat. I don't care if it's fresh, if it's new, if it's clean. I still hate the smell of it. Hold on. Journey, you're not even supposed to be up there, okay? You're not even supposed to be getting the cup right now. I just gave her some milk. But, yeah, did y'all know that? Because I'm, that's, that's new to me. That was news to me, honey. My teeth hurt, y'all, so I can't keep doing my voiceovers until my teeth really heal. So, I'm going to just have to add music. But I love y'all so much. Thank you for the support. And I'm going to just add music because my mouth is really starting to hurt. Peace out, y'all. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say it.
stayed in the alley as bitch you guessed me Oh, oh, yeah, I got you Too bad I'm bothered, nigga, I'll be fine without you Guess you found out all the models wasn't about you And now you're gonna waste your time chasing me Nigga, please Ain't no need to waste your time being caught up over me Nigga, please I don't wanna hear about it, you can tell your friends about it Now you wishing you was with me living life so true Giving on your friend that I was cool They don't know that you be on that bullshit Even though they didn't think that I was so good But I ain't tripping, just don't push it It's cool, I'ma focus on my vision Cause you only get one pass
2017, all good, chuck a look around, find one to see my type, damn my dog and he know what I like, he done found me plenty in my life, problem is I meet a girl tonight, then I go and treat her too nice, gallery of credit card swipes, I don't even know if she a wife, but I do know one thing though, women they come they go, Saturday through Sunday, Monday, Monday through Sunday, yo, baby.
I'm gonna go to the bed and 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 I'm g